waiting for. I've been waiting for it for months. I just got back from seeing mom. Mom was everything and more than you could ever expect. Oh my God. We're gonna start this review off right. The first thing you guys need to know is Octavia Spencer has broken her mold. She broke that old crusty mold of the Manny Mish role, the help. The Driver Miss Daisy is the only way I can get some awards role. Octavia Spencer is now a full fledged, all out, bona fide, crazy ass American psycho killer. <laughs> She's excellent, excellent, and funny, clever. Well, she was already, you know, an Oscar award winning actress, and baby, it came through. Movie is great. Okay, short review. Uh, credits in a minute. <laughs> I'm not telling y'all nothing on this one. Bye. Okay, everyone. Ma is wickedly clever and wonderful. Ma embodies Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf, Elizabeth Taylor, and whatever happened to Baby Jane, the great Betty Davis. And after you see this movie, you're going to be thinking, what the hell happened to Ma? <laughs> So here we go. And that's the crux of this movie review today. Ma was directed by Tate Taylor, who has directed um, Octavia Spencer in several of the collaborative films. Uh, big backstory. Ma and, I mean, not Ma, I'm calling her Ma. Oh my God. <laughs> Octavia Spencer and Tate Taylor, the director, go way back. They were friends before all this filmmaking. They were even roommates at one point. So they have a long history as far as friendship goes. The film Ma uh, has a really large cast. It stars, of course, Octavia Spencer, as you know. Uh, she played the role of Sue Ann or Ma. And it also stars the director. He has a small part. He's Officer Granger, this Tate Taylor. So I guess he just wanted a cameo. And then there are some young folks that I want to mention. Corey Fogelmanis, Diana Silver, Luke Evans, McKelly Miller, and let's not forget the great Juliette Lewis. She has a small role in here. She's always a great actor. Whatever role they give her, she pulls it off. She was the mother to one of the teens that was visiting Ma's house. Saw a tape at that part. Ma was co-produced by Tate Taylor, John Norris, and Jason Bloom. Yeah, that's Jason Bloom of Bloom House Productions. Now, you know, that's big. Bloom House has had his hand in every creepy production in probably over the last 20 years. Big names such as Get Out, Us, The Purge, Insidious, Split, Happy Death Day, etc., etc. So, it's a big production house for creepiness. <laughs> Octavia Spencer is so great in this movie. She is mesmerizing in the delivery of every line. Her face articulates every sentiment she is either saying or conveying. Whether she's just looking at the camera or whatever she says, it's amazing. Her facial expressions. I think that's a sign of a great actress with just one look. <laughs> the look says it all. No words. So as the story goes, Ma is a dowdy middle-aged woman who has some unresolved childhood issues. Seriously. <laughs> She seeks revenge by befriending the local town's children and partying with them. That's as much as a giveaway I'm going to tell you. And she does this to relive parts of her youth and regain, I suspect, what she felt was stolen from her. Or so she perceives. Perception is everything. There are really great scenes with Octavia. She runs the entire movie and her party scenes with the teens are intense and phenomenal. There are lots more details to this movie, but that would make this a spoiler review. If not, I'm not gonna do a spoiler, okay? You get the gist of it. So this is short and sweet. Octavia has finally crossed that line. Yeah, she crossed that line. The line from the back door to the front door in Hollywood. <laughs> Coincidentally, my ma, or mother as I like to call her, she enjoyed the film immensely. The audience reaction was hyped and engaged. It was great. However, sad to say, with Octavia Spencer's star power, this really is her very first starring role. 
And we all know she's a great actress. She's an Oscar award winning and multi-nominated actress. And to have this be her very first role after all of these years, what does that say about you, Hollywood and America? Shame on you. In that order, her first starring role. Finally, Octavia Spencer is super convincing as Crazy Psycho Ma. <laughs> so get your butts down there and party with Ma. Ma will supply the alcohol. <laughs> I'm certain of that. Absolutely no children. Absolutely no children, okay? <laughs> I give Ma a big 4.5 out of 5. Great movie, executed well, and just think, it's a B-movie, because it's just a little horror flick. But hey, it was pretty good. Okay, guys, that's it. This is Favorite Day signing off. Get down there and see Ma, and I tell you, it was wonderful. Good night. Bye. Hey, everyone. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoy movie reviews with Favorite Nate. Please hit the subscribe button, hit the subscribe button, and I'll catch you next time at the movies.